I look like a turtle. I feel like a turtle. Do I look like a turtle? So this is going to be a stories time series, which I'm going to share with you my most embarrassing stories. I have four of them. Of course I embarrass myself on the reg, um, but these are the highlights, which just tells you how luscious they are. <laughs> I might have mentioned a couple of them before, but I'm going to go into sordid detail. Uh, Sadaf is over here. It feels better if I like tell this to somebody. Just makes it more interactive, I guess. Somebody can laugh at you. Yeah, okay. laugh at the good parts <laughs> or the horrible parts. So the first one is going to be, hold on, I wrote them down. Um, you get to, uh, okay, I'll let you choose. Okay. So, walrus, mini golf, C2C, or underwear presentation. Underwear presentation. <laughs> Okay, so this would be, I would be 20 years old. This is when I was going to Harrisburg Area Community College and I was taking the photography course. I think, I think this is, uh, this is, okay, so I was taking the photography course and it was on a Saturday and <clears throat> I work during the week. I'll have a basket of clean clothing next to my bed, not folded, just clean and I will pull from it. I have not changed. I am old now and I still do the same thing. Like when my closet is all hung up and pristine, I feel so proud of myself. I'm like adulting. I got up that morning. It was like an early 8 a.m. class. I was running late. Literally just threw on the pair of pants, shirt, got my um, art boards which were the the works that we were critiquing that day and flew into class with like seconds to spare so I'm sitting there and it's it's towards the end of the year so it's not like I didn't know anybody in the class so like I became friends with a lot of them and people are going up and doing their presentation showing their work yada 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 and I decide it's time for me to go up and all of a sudden I feel itchy in my legs oh, no. and I'm like oh. so I'm scratching it and I don't really notice anything like it's not something I focused on but it's something I'm doing like itching so I stand up and while I'm walking to the front of the classroom the itching starts even more and then all of a sudden the itching stops and it was like this relief but then at the same time my underwear <laughs> shoot in front of me <laughs> down the aisle to the front of the classroom literally they like shot on like you know like tile surface how it like just skids to the very front and everyone in their seats are just <laughs> and I recognize it as my own. <laughs> like, there's no, there's no way in AG Double Hockey Six that this is not my own underwear. Oh, I'm, I'm guessing it was clean and inside my Probably. pants when I stuck them on, and it just sort of, with my itching, made its way down to my shoe, and then shot forward when it decided to... At least it wasn't the pair you were wearing. Yeah, that's true. That would have been more difficult to come <laughs> off. <laughs> so, that's not even the end of it. Um, so, my embarrassment was so acute that I couldn't admit that they were my underwear. So I lied. And I said, oh, it must have been from somebody using the classroom for multi-purposes. I don't think I'm the one that said that, but I think a couple of the kids started making fun of like people getting busy in the room using it for extracurricular <laughs> and I was just like oh my god so I pick them up and I throw them in the trash can and 
because I couldn't admit that they were mine. It's not like I could pick them up and go, oh, for later. <laughs> I was so embarrassed, like I felt ill. And uh, the teacher was like, oh my God, you're so red. Are you getting like, are you okay? And I go, yeah, I just feel like really disgusted. Can I go wash my hands? <laughs> they're my own underwear. And I was like acting like they're not, my oh, it was just a hot mess. Please forgive me, I was 20 years old. <laughs> That is underwear presentation. To this day, it might be, it's definitely up there with one of the most embarrassing stories. I, you know what, I'm not gonna lie. I think those people were just joking around. I think they all knew it was my underwear. <laughs> they're trying to cover you. Yeah, they're being nice. So, I hope you enjoyed this and I hope you had a good chuckle. Hopefully you're having a good Ramadan and I'll see you next story time.